Hi, everybody. James Sabolski back here for EA Sports. Well, the battle lines were drawn in game one. What's in store for game two of this series? Both teams are lined up, and we are set to get things going. A critical game for both sides here, and we are underway. Denies him on a slapper. Campbell's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. McDavid's gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. And now he moves into dry sidle. Edmonton's in transition. New York's ready to go on the attack. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Let's get the call here. McDavid's called for tripping. He's off to the box. New York's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, hard work earns the first power play of the game for them, and now they've got to take advantage of it. They'll start with the face-off, of course, in the offensive zone. Shot in front, and that's blocked away. Edmonton's on the attack. Puck picked up by Nelson. Oh, that's poked away in the offensive zone by Hyman. New York's got the puck, and now he moves it quickly to Barzell. That pass doesn't go. Lee's got it in the offensive zone. Stops him with the glove. Campbell's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Ryan's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Faceoff coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? Pachos won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Scores a power play goal! Now, you know, James, I made a living on the power play. You got to keep listening to my stories all the time, but once you get on a power play that's rolling, you feel like there's a couple of different options. This team is good with the man advantage. Thankfully, your stories are good, too, Ferraro. Yeah, I don't know. That. The Islanders win possession here in the open ice. Taken by Nugent Hopkins. The Islanders have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Edmonton's three-game possession with a puck. From the opposite point. The Oilers look around near the point. Puck grabbed by Wallstrom. Gets it over to Nelson. Just a crushing hit against the wall. Yeah, sending a message early there, James. He gets the body contact. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Sends it out in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Takes it along the wall by Nurse. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. New York's looking to break out. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Scooped up along the wall by Romanov. Parisi's got it against the boards. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. New York's got possession at center. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it to Murray. Edmonton's gained the line and into the zone. New York's gained possession along the boards. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Directed over to Pasho. The Islanders carried along the wall. The Oilers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to McDavid. And a good, solid hit on that play. And that pass doesn't go. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. 
here in the late going of the frame. One nothing the score. Edmonton's won the draw. Hey, maybe it can create some offense against the tired team after the icing. Denies him again. Quick feed to pull up. Up along the wing. Takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Fogel. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Yanmar. The Islanders take over on possession. Nice pass save. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. And there's a little boost from off the wing as the centers were tied up there. Passes over to McLeod. The buzzer that puts the ball on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Ray Ferraro's between the benches. Razor, give me a sense of how you see things so far. The Oilers are lucky there's still 40 minutes left in this game. They played a rotten first period in particular. They were sloppy with the puck, turned it over all over the place. Can't get it to go. Can't make it work. And he turned that one aside. Lots of time left in this period. one nothing is where we sit at this point. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. The Islanders will play it in their own end. New York's got him along the wall. Moves it to the middle, and he denies that great opportunity there. Nelson's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Denied by Campbell. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Denied by the goaltender. And this is a constant battle for the goalie to find the puck. This is why they work on this tracking stuff. Find the puck in one direction, lose it, and then pick it up again. He does that well to make the save. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Islanders lead it 1-0. Puck scooped up by Nurse. Backtracks with possession back inside the defensive zone. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here's the official call. The Islanders will serve two minutes in the box. Edmonton sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Down one, a chance to tie on the power play. What a great chance for them here. But you can't stress, you have to be confident and aggressive, but don't force anything. The Oilers will play the puck from behind the net. Into the offensive zone, down the right wing. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Couldn't complete the play. Janmark's got it behind the net. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Scrum along the wall. Edmonton's got the puck. Let's the wrister fly. Blocked by the defender. Nice play. And the stick is best from on that save right there. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. 
Faisal. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as the face-off is ready to go. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. New York ready to go on the attack. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. And now it's over to Kane. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. The pass in front. Oh, what a chance. And he fanned on the puck. Ajo's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. It's a step back for them now. They're shorthanded, but their penalty killers can do a job, and they can maybe gain that momentum back. Most teams are going to start in this 1-3-1 set. The key, though, is you've got to move once you get possession of the puck. If you move, the penalty killers have to follow. Take advantage of that extra player. And that's deflected. And now it's grabbed by Fogel. New York's got it in the neutral zone. The Islanders have it against the wall. And now he angles it across to Wallstrom. Here's the pass. And that's deflected off someone in front. Picked up along the boards by Barzell. He scores! Add that power play goal to the earlier one. They've really done well with the extra man here. New York's now up by two in the second. They worked hard to push this lead from one to two. I like the way that they've been playing. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. The Islanders have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Bellows. Takes the feed. And a little physical there with that collision. Battle along the wall. The Islanders have it from their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Moves it to Bellows. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. In the final moments of this period, the Islanders now lead by two. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Bouchard's got it in the defensive end. Can't make the connection on the pass. Moves it quickly over to Ryan. Can't connect. Hangs onto the puck. Sends the pass in front. The shot! The Oilers like the left! Edmonton's got a chance to change the complexion of this game now with that one. Yeah, get one now, they're within one. Don't take a step back. Push forward. Look for the equalizer. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Moves the puck to Dreisaitl. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. There's the horn. Two periods down. A third period to go. Stick around and join us for the drama next. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. All right, the puck is dropped on the third and final frame. Ray Ferraro is at ice level, and Ray, as third period action gets underway, give us a sense of how you've seen things tonight. The Oilers game, if it's going to turn around, is going to start with better puck possession. When they have it, hold on to it. Don't hand it to the other guys. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The Oilers still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. No room for that one to get through. Here's the pass in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Nice. 
Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. The Islanders win it in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Quick feed to Yamamoto. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. And the play continues. Quick feed to Yamamoto. Takes a wrist shot, turns it aside with the glove. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Nearing the midway mark of the period, New York's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Tries to dangle, and the puck skips away. Don't mind the idea, but it doesn't work. Now you got to chase. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. Passes the puck over to Pullock. The Islanders gain possession. Nelson scudded across the line. Quick feed down low. Here's a short pass to Beauvillier. Centering feed. Shot. Scores! The Islanders now lead by two with less than half this period to go here. Huge. It really is, and they can still stay aggressive. Melt the game down with three or four really good shifts. Then you get into a comfortable place you can manage your way home. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. And a little body contact on that play. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Fires it into the offensive zone. Romanov's lugging the puck. The Islanders play it along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Dobson. Puck picked up by McLeod. Into the offensive zone. Here's a pass in front. Off a stick and they can't complete the play. Handles the puck at the point. Quick pass to McLeod. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. I guess this is another reason the position is so hard, James. You make that first save, but you're not done. Here comes another one. You've got to be in good enough shape to make that second save. Here in the later stages of this period, the Islanders have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Quick pass across to Fogel. And he takes the pass. And now he tries to get it across to Yanmark. Centering feed! And that's stopped! Goaltender covers up and will get a face-off. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Edmonton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Stones him with the blocker! Strong fundamental save there. You make the save, you get it to the corner. That's puck control. The Oilers have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. And that's picked off by Vogel. And now he moves it to Yanmark. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. The Islanders played along the boards. Sends it ahead to Yamamoto. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves it to Bailey. Fails to find the open man. Cuts to the front. Great save from in tight. Off the bar. I think that caught the inside of the post. Extra attacker at one end, but an empty net at the other as this face-off looms. Yeah, you draw the play up. You look for the face-off win for a quick shot. McDavid's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. That's off a stick. Taken by Mayfield. Feeds it over to Wallstrom. Off 
target. And that will close the book on this one here tonight. Now down 2-0. Time to hit the panic button in your mind yet? Oh, you're getting there. You're down two. There's not much room for any air left. They had the air pushed out of them tonight. Thanks so much for joining us for this postseason action, and we will see you at the next playoff game. See you, everybody.